Welcome back everyone. We're going to be solving Lee code 186, reverse words in a string 2. So we're given a character array s. We need to reverse the words or the order of the words, right? So if we take a look at example 1, we're given the character array uh, with the words the sky is blue. And we need to give an output of blue is sky the. And they want us to do this without allocating any extra space, right? So in place. How can we solve this in place? Because it would be super simple just to return, you know, the reversed order of our array. But again, they don't want us to do that. So what we're going to do in order to solve this in place is use two pointers. We'll say left and right are going to be equal to zero, and then the length of our uh, given input array minus one. This will put our pointers. Uh, left at T and R at E. Now the first thing we're going to do is do one pass through our array and swap all of the characters. This is going to give us the correct ordering of our words in our output array. However, every single one of our words will be reversed. So we'll have to do another pass in order to reverse the characters of each word after we do this. And I'll show you what I mean. So let's say uh, while left is less than or equal to right, we just want to swap the characters. So we'll say s of l, comma s of r is going to be equal to s of r, comma s of l. Now we can increment our left pointer by one, decrement right by one. So we'll run this to see what I'm talking about. Okay, see, now we have blue in the correct position, but the word is reversed. Is is in the correct position, sky and the are also in the correct position, but everything is reversed, right? So now we need to, we need to just create uh, or reset our pointers and then just do another pass through, right? Super simple. So, but this time we're going to set our left and right pointers equal to zero. So we'll start left and right at E, and while our right pointer has not hit a space character, we're going to increment that pointer. So left will be at left and right will be at E, increment R to U to L to B to the space. Okay, now what? Now we're going to create a variable called index. We're going to set it to zero initially. Now when our right pointer um, ever hits a space character, we're going to set our index to this pointer because we want to remember this position. And then we're going to decrement right by one so we can get the last character in our word that we just found. And then we're just going to reverse the uh, characters in the word, right? So let's do that. We'll say while left is less than or equal to right, we want to say if the character at the right position is not equal to a space character, we just want to increment right by one. Otherwise, if it is equal to a space character, right, the first thing we want to do is set our index equal to the right pointer. So we'll say index is equal to r, and then we will decrement r by 1. Now we can just run this loop again so we can reverse the words in the word we just found. So we'll say while left is less than or equal to right, we're going to say s of left, comma, s of right. It's going to be equal to s of right, comma, s of left, increment left by 1, decrement uh, right by 1. And then, okay, now that we have reversed the word, our right pointer is going to be somewhere within the word, right? This is why we remembered an index. So we can reset our right pointer equal to the character after the space. So we can find the next word. So now, just like I said, we can reset right to be index plus one. And then we also want to move our left pointer up to be equal to our right pointer. So L can be equal to R now. OK, let's run this. It won't work just yet, but we will be pretty close. Uh, list index out of range. What did I do here? Is not equal to less than or equal to. Okay, this while loop should be while right is less than the length of our string. So let's rerun this. Okay, so we've got, we've almost got the output, right? The last case we need to handle is when our 
right pointer or when we run into the very last word in our string, right? Well, when we exit this while loop, let's print out our left and right pointers just to see what has happened. So our left pointer is at 12 and our right pointer is at 15. So let's find these positions. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So left is at T, 13, 14, 15. So right has now uh, gone over the length of our string. So what can we do in order to reverse the last word? Because we already have our left pointer in the correct position, right? It's at that very first character in our last word. So in order to handle this last case of the last word in our string, we can just decrement r by 1 and then just do one more loop to uh, reverse the word. So we'll decrement r by 1, and then we'll say while left is less than or equal to r, we will just say s of l comma s of r is going to be equal to s of r comma s of l, increment left by 1, decrement right by 1, and that should be it. So let's get rid of some spaces here and before we run this. Okay. And look at that, we pass both test cases, so we'll submit. And we do pass, perfect. So time and space complexity. Uh, space complexity, obviously O of one, right? We follow the directions, code must solve this problem in place without allocating any extra space. Time complexity is going to be um, O of n, right? We're doing an O of n pass here. We're doing an O of n pass here. And then we are also doing an O of n uh, pass here and even though this is nested this loop is going to run o of n so our time complexity is going to be o of n in this case so that'll do it for leetcode 186